In this section, we're going to talk some more about points, and specifically about the rebuild command. Now, the rebuild command can be used on more than just curves. It will actually work on some shapes as well. So let's create a curve. It's going to lay down a bunch of points. Close my curve. Now then, edit, rebuild. When I click that, my rebuild curve menu pops up. I can change the degree. We'll just leave that to, by a uh, default of 3. Create new curve on current layer. Delete input. This, What this is going to do is delete the current curve the way it is now, as opposed to just copying it. Point count, 12. This can be changed. The 19 in parentheses is the current point count. Let's just go to, we'll say 40, and let's press OK. Not much of a change, that you could tell, but then when I turn on my control points, suddenly there's a lot more points involved. And the same with my edit points. Now again, let's go to Rebuild. This time we'll choose 20, and I'll uncheck Delete Input. Let's watch what happens. Now, as you can see, I have two curves. It's showing me the before and after, so to speak. So the Rebuild tool will let you adjust the complexity of your shapes to fit your specific needs, whether you need a curve to be more complex or less. Now, what about a sphere? So I'll start here. Let's go to about there. If I turn on my edit points, gives me the message that only curves are available for edit points. Control points is going to look like this. Let's select, edit, rebuild. The rebuild surface menu looks a little bit different. My degree comes in two dimensions, U and V. Retrim, current layer, delete input again. This time we'll leave delete input unchecked so we can see both the new and the old sphere. Now let's change this to 4 and see what happens. Not a whole lot, pretty hard to tell. But if I turn on my points, a lot less points with the new sphere. You could also have made it a lot more complicated. Let's try 80. And you can see just by my wireframe preview that this is much more complex. So that, in essence, is the rebuild command.